Small sweet peppers blistered on a hot grill sprinkled with chopped garlic and capers drizzled with aged balsamic vinegar. One bite and you will understand why this is the best grilled sweet peppers recipe ever. This sensational side dish recipe is an answer to your requests for more quick and easy side dish recipes. Just like our grilled carrot recipe, just like our green beans with dill, and our lemony orzo pasta with asparagus, this one is quick and easy to make. Better still, it's extra delicious. Let me show you how to make them. Begin by turning your grill or barbecue on. You want it at 500 degrees Fahrenheit. You're gonna need two pounds of mini sweet peppers for the recipe. Give them a rinse, then drizzle them with a tiny bit of extra virgin olive oil and a sprinkle of kosher salt. Pro tip, you're gonna be barbecuing the peppers in a grill basket, so line the basket with foil makes cleanup way easier, just saying. Toss the peppers, then spill them into a lined grill basket. But before heading to the grill, do this. Peel two cloves of garlic, roughly chop them. Then add in two tablespoons of capers, roughly chop those two ingredients together. Before heading to the grill, let's set up a post-grill station. The chopped capers and garlic are there. The bowl from the pepper toss, no need to wash it. We have extra virgin olive oil and aged balsamic vinegar, salt, and pepper at the ready. Now grab some tongs, time to grill those sweet little peppers. Place the basket on a hot grill, shut the lid, then toss the peppers every three minutes or so. You want them blistered. A little bit of blackened color is good. Just keep tossing. Your total grill time is 10 to 15 minutes. When the peppers are done to your liking, take the basket off the grill carefully and bring it into your post grill station. Transfer the peppers to a bowl, add the chopped garlic and capers, do a tiny drizzle of extra virgin olive oil, add a swish of aged balsamic vinegar, a sprinkle of kosher salt and black pepper, then toss to combine. We're gonna cover with foil and leave the peppers to wilt for 10 minutes. That is it. The peppers are ready to be enjoyed. Full recipe is up at Weekend at the Cottage for you to reference. When you're visiting our website, please subscribe to it. Look for this video on our dedicated YouTube channel. Yes, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. And then finally, take a picture of all the beautiful food you're making. Just use hashtag Weekend at the Cottage when you post those pics on your favorite socials like Pinterest, Instagram, and Facebook. This is the best grilled sweet pepper recipe ever. Perfect grilled peppers. Mm.